Hi, I am R.G. Tanner and this is Misadventures of a Schizophrenic. I just want to welcome back any returning viewers and if you're new I hope you like it. Today I wanted to talk about some of the side effects of medications. So if you've seen any of my previous videos you'll notice that I blink a lot. I just blink, 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 blink and you know, a lot of that is because my medications have caused something called tardic dyskinesia. That is loss of the ability to regulate your blinks, regulate your mouth activity. So I end up choking on a lot of fluids because my tongue doesn't work quite the right way. I rock a lot back and forth. I do that in bed. In fact, on the night before my wedding, uh, my husband, he at the time, fiance, he couldn't get to sleep because I wasn't there rocking and he had gotten so used to that fact. And so I rock, I bounce my foot back and forth and I oftentimes, see, I just kicked right there. You could probably see the camera move. I kicked the tripod because my foot is always bouncing. And it... I didn't realize that this was happening and so um, it was brought to my attention by actually at the time I was volunteering at a nursing home and one of the residents brought it to my attention that I was twitching and it was abnormal and I had a doctor check it out and they're like yeah you've probably got tired of dyskinesia and so if you see someone that's blinking a lot or just moving a lot, rocking a lot, you know, maybe don't be so quick to judge them because they might have something going on where they're on a medication that does help. It does help with the mental stuff, but physically it causes some side effects. And the fact of the matter is about these side effects, they're not going to get any better. They are only going to get worse the longer you stay on the antipsychotics. And Unfortunately, it's choosing the lesser of two evils. Do you want to be mentally stable and sane? Or do you want to be physically stable and not twitching? You know, you have to choose between the two. And I have opted for the first, which is the mental stability. And so if you may see videos of schizophrenics that are well into their 70s that started taking these antipsychotics in their 20s and they cannot hold still this is not an uncommon thing and is just a trade-off that you make but hopefully with the new advances in medicine they will be addressing this I honestly couldn't tell you I don't know what strides in medicine are being made towards this just gotta bring some attention to this one thing you gotta know about me I absolutely love coffee I have coffee in the morning I have coffee in the afternoon I have coffee at night and this is my French press. It's called. It's a cinnamon flavor. Ah, so good. And so, if you need to know anything about me, one big fact: I love coffee. So anyway, you know, if you see someone twitching, if you see someone kind of bouncing around, maybe think to yourself: maybe they're on medications and they just can't control it, or maybe they find the rocking soothing, and you know, and it helps ease a mental side effect. You know, and some of these side effects are really not that bad. I don't notice the twitching, the rocking, the blinking. You know, I don't notice it anymore. I actually had someone's family tell me that they were so afraid that it was contagious, they wouldn't make eye contact with me. So I had someone's family tell me they would not make eye contact with me because they thought that my blinking was contagious. So don't be like that family, don't be like them, don't think that it's contagious, don't think that any mental symptom is contagious because it's not, it never is. So just, you know, kind of take into consideration that there are some extenuating circumstances, especially when coming to the side effects of mental medications. So maybe just, you know, kind of give a little bit more sympathy, a little bit more leeway, and realize that people are doing the best with what they've got. And just because you have a side effect doesn't mean that the medication isn't working, because my medications work wonders. They really do, and I am not about to go off of them because I do a little bit of twitching. You know, and I'm going to keep that, you know, twitch where I knocked the tripod in there just to show you that, you know, this is real. This is real. This is the real deal. And 
so I hope you don't think that I'm weird because I'm Blinky Magoo over here. You know, it's just part of what I have to do, go through. If you knew me as a person, just in person, you, you space out the blinks. You space out the rocking. You space out the foot, tw the foot twitching. So if you want to read more about my day-to-day -day life as a schizophrenic, please visit www.misadventuresofaschizophrenic.wordpress.com And if you would like to know more about mental health, go to NAMI.org. And if you really feel like you need mental assistance right now, please call the number below. This is the NAMI support line. It is nationwide. And I hope you hit that little subscribe button. Keep coming back. I make new videos all the time. And I hope that, you know, you enjoy these videos and tune in for the next one. See you later.